Hey Coco here, your Los Gatos Saratoga real estate agent and strategist. I apologize for the sound, the background sound. I am actually standing in downtown Saratoga in one of the quad areas, which is like the famous um, landmark that they have here. So I wanted to show you guys that. Now, today's video is going to be about why people are moving to Saratoga. So if you're interested, stay on this video. I'm gonna give you the three main reasons why people are flocking to Saratoga and a few things to consider at the end to help you out to see if it's the right place for you. All right, let's get into it. Oh, real quick, if you have not already, make sure to subscribe to my channel, click the bell. You wanna be alerted when my new videos come out. I'm gonna be bringing you property tours, more information on Saratoga, Los Gatos, and surrounding areas here in Silicon Valley, Northern California. And I'm also gonna be talking about different restaurants, business owners, all sorts of cool stuff so you really get a feel for what this community is and what it's all about. So I hope you subscribe, don't forget, and join my video. All right, let's get into it. One, what is the biggest reason why people are coming to Saratoga and they're so interested in coming to Saratoga? If you have looked at the home prices in Saratoga, California, you might be shocked. It's really expensive. So a lot of people will save up or they have the money and they wanna be in a more affluent area. It doesn't matter the reason, Saratoga is just expensive. Why everybody asks me? It's because of the schools. The schools in Saratoga are top notch and they have been ranked number one many times. People will come to Saratoga either to rent, to buy. They, I have seen people buy little shacks. I have seen people buy mansions. It doesn't matter. I helped one of my clients buy a condo that was $3 million. So they will come for what they need to do to get into the schools because they want their kids to be able to go to the Saratoga schools. All right, two, the community. This is a t small town feel wrapped around in Silicon Valley. We are, San Francisco is not far from here. San Jose is about 15, 20 minutes, maybe 30 minutes from here. I have um, Apple Campus 15 minutes. I have Googleplex 33 minutes. We are close by tech. We are close by everything here. I can go down to Santa Cruz and be at the beach in about 30 minutes. It is an amazing location yet you feel like you're in a small town. It is so cool. Businesses are, a lot of them are small business here, and we like that. So Saratoga has community. People will be out walking around, riding their bikes, hiking, whatever it is that they like to do, people are very active here. So that's two. And three is really the food scene, right? Saratoga is an affluent area and we have a lot of really cool restaurants out here. That's why I can't wait to bring you my community page where I get to interview these restaurant owners and go tell you about the food because I love it and I wanna share it with you. So here you go, you got it, it's the schools, it's the community, it's the food and there's so many more reasons but those are the three biggest reasons. When I ask my clients, why do you wanna pick Saratoga over Los Gatos, right? And it does depend on your location and where you need to go on the other areas. And I'll talk about those areas in different videos. All right, what do you gotta know about Saratoga that hey, you should know, right? It's expensive. Shh, don't tell anybody. I think they already know. It is pricey and there is a price limit to get into it. So if you are looking to get into Saratoga and your price range is lower, it's gonna be hard to get here. So when you're looking at homes in Saratoga with Saratoga schools, because again, that's why people move to Saratoga, some will choose it and go across 85 on the east side of 85, and that there does have Campbell School, so the prices are a little bit lower, still a very beautiful and nice area. So you can look at two things. You want to either have the schools and be in Saratoga, or you just want to be able to say, I live in Saratoga. My buyers kind of go both ways. It depends on the person and what they want. The other thing is it's expensive to live here. And with that, you do have a little bit more of the homes being on hills. So Saratoga has some flat areas. Like I said, if you cross over east of 85, the freeway, um, you will find more flat land. But if you want the schools, you have to come west of 85. When you come west of 85, you're gonna find more homes that are up in the hills. So if you're not interested in being part of the hills, then you have to be more strategic on where you buy your homes in Saratoga to ensure that you're getting more of the flat land. But I will tell you, because I have helped many of my clients, if you want a home with a little bit more of a feel of that you are 
in a different world. This is like, I like to tell them like, you're in a different world. It feels like, you know, you're in a whole different state and you're just here in um, Saratoga. You don't need to go far up the hills. You don't have to go up these steep inclines or super windy roads, but there is a little bit of a drive and it's not as walkable as many of the other homes I've shown you in my tour. So keep that in mind, but I love Saratoga. I was born and raised here in the Bay Area. Saratoga is one of my favorite places to be. I come to eat food, I bring my children, I come to the events, as I told you, I'm part of the Chambers of Commerce here. It, it is just a beautiful area. So again, if you are interested in buying a home in Saratoga, California, I help international clients with luxury home buying and selling. So if you're interested, reach out and let me know. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave me a comment below. I wanna make better videos for you. So if you're interested in learning more about something, post it below and I'm happy to make a video on it. And as always, thank you for joining me on my channel. I can't wait to see you in the next video.